There are growing concerns in Egypt about handling the country's increasing medical waste. The government has been seeking to find the safest and most efficient ways to deal with the huge pileup of waste since the outbreak of the coronavirus pandemic, such as used syringes, old personal protective equipment kits and empty vaccine bottles. Health authorities hope to minimize the risk posed by such hazardous waste. The volume of medical waste in Egypt is about 3.5 million tons, coming out of about 336,000 medical facilities, from hospitals to labs, clinics around the country. In 2020, President Abdel Fattah el-Sisi ratified a new law that established a waste management unit to ensure the safe treatment of waste through recycling, for instance, and for medical waste, how to sterilize the dangerous waste and bury it in safe landfills that don't harm the citizens. A strategy for waste management was set up that includes digitizing the system to monitor the cycle of healthcare waste from the source until its disposal. It also includes training professionals in the field, merging the private sector and civil society in these activities and establishing nine new waste transfer stations and 20 sanitary landfills. Member of Parliament Meshwal Sharif has been active in this process. I submitted a draft plan on waste management after personally researching the successful Chinese experience during my visit to China, how they manage this complicated system, the huge, huge plants and capabilities and technology in this field. My plan focuses on cooperation between China and Egypt so that the transfer of knowledge and technology will greatly benefit our waste management and recycling strategy. This plan, alongside other initiatives, is expected to be implemented by the government in 2022 to upgrade its capabilities as the North African country continues the fight against the persistent coronavirus pandemic.